Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of the Planet Crafter. Uh, I'm just cleaning up my inventory right now. I think I'm going to go on a little bit of a little bit of a resource run. Uh, what I want to do today is uh, I want to start getting a little bit of, a bit of a progression. Uh, a couple of things I actually want to do is one is I want to get a T4 backpack, a T4 oxygen tank, and if I can. Uh, get a jetpack going. Uh, I do need to pick up some iridium. I know I'm gonna need that for a few things. Uh, I've been thinking about this one here about the ore extractor. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I just realized I need osmium, which I haven't even found yet. So that's something we'll have to go exploring for. I was gonna get that on the aluminum, but I guess that's not really the, the case because we need the super alloy for it. And then I need the super alloy for the launch platform, and we need super alloy for the biodome, and we need super alloy, actually no, we need the iridium rods for the heater, so we can make that if we had the iridium, but we don't. So what we're going to do is we're going to go for a little, uh, a little bit of an exploration run. Uh, what I'm going to do before we go is I'm going to harvest my food, go ahead and replant the beans and the squash. Uh, I probably won't harvest anymore, I'll just probably leave it like that. And then I'm going to leave the squash here for now. Uh, probably could take one water with me, or I can wait until we get over there, because I think I have a, I think I have a crafting terminal in that base. Let's take some iron silicone just in case. Uh, by the, the other base, I mean the ship over there. Uh, I had, I do know that I can find, actually, actually find super alloy over there, so that's what we're gonna do. Oh, just in time for the rain, what do you know? Anyway, off we go. Uh, the reason why I wanna get the bigger backpack of course you just be able to carry more stuff and the bigger oxygen tank so I don't need to worry about oxygen as much um, regarding the vitals uh, it was mentioned that the the vitals do sort of reset upon load like the food and the uh, the hunger and the thirst and it is supposedly by game design I'm not gonna abuse that I'll do my best not to abuse it or exploit or in any way whatsoever unless it's an absolute emergency but I do know that the oxygen doesn't replenish, so that's something I do have to keep an eye out for. And, uh... Yeah, gotta love these early access games. It's almost like we're inside a cave right now, and I can't even see the ship we're going to right now. But, uh, when we get here, I don't know if you noticed in the last episode when we were exploring the aluminum zone, I did set up sort of a staircase up on the cliff, and I did happen to see, like, there's stuff up there for... A little bit of exploration, I think there's stuff I can loot up there. I know uh, super alloy can actually be found in this one particular area. So it might be better to do that. Oh, I do have one of them. Good, now I just need to, need to get some ice. Uh, let me find some ice, and I'll bring you back when the weather subsides. Huh, funny, usually when I start recording, it starts to rain. This time when I stopped recording, it stopped raining. Huh, interesting. Anyways, uh, up here you can see my staircase. I did do, like I said, I did a little bit of exploring earlier. Um, I think it was before I started the last episode or partway through or whatever. I can't remember. But I had to sort of sidestep the stair like this. I don't know if I can actually get up here. Eventually. Good thing fall damage isn't a thing. At least I'm not, that, not that I'm aware of. I don't know if it's something they'll ever put back into the game, but... I know I have gotten up here before. That's how I'm getting up here now. Oh. We got collision issues. Something tells me I'm not supposed to be here. Early access games, gotta love them. All right, look at that, super alloy. Just so easy, and what is that? Aluminum, might as well grab that. And yeah. Uh, Go around and collect some stuff. Uh, I think there was uh, something to explore, but I'll bring you back when I get to that. Okay, well, I found this, but I don't think I'm going to be able to explore because I don't have any oxygen left over. I already used my bottle, and uh, we're running low. Let's see if I can get over there at least. Have a little peek. This is definitely a maze. Oh, I almost fell down too. Hopefully, I can make it. I do have a full inventory too, so I can't really pick up much, too much else. Yeah, interesting. Please tell me I can find some oxygen or something. Probably not. Nope. Not gonna make it. 
Oh, I'm gonna hate it. Oxygen? No. No oxygen. Uh, I don't think my fan made it else. Anyway, I'm gonna see if we can make it back. No, I did not make it. I lost all the super alloy I found too. But I don't think my chest was very far. I guess I don't know where it was. Be nice if there was a beacon to show you where you perished. I know it wasn't too far. I think it was actually like right near somewhere. I dropped down. Apparently, fall damage is a thing. Uh, let's go ahead and drink that for now, and I'll see if I can find out where I where I last was. Okay, I found it. And I got back to the pod just in time. And look at that. Look at all this grass. How much is left on it? It's 100%. So now I think I just picked this up and move it somewhere else. And we can start growing more. I'm going to have to get the neighbor's kid over to cut my lawn one of these days. Anyway, uh, I do have a lot of super alloy. I should have grabbed a little more aluminum. I don't know how much I need for the jetpack or the backpack and oxygen tank. Let's have a look. I needed none. Oh, good. So I just need cobalt and super alloy. And a clean inventory. Uh, let me see. Cobalt. Take you. Uh, titanium. Nope, that's not titanium. That's titanium. I'm going to run all the way back over here. And then we'll, take the, we'll do the oxygen tank first. Okay, it gives a load of oxygen. And then... We have a flower pot ready. Alright, uh, let's dump some stuff in here so I can take my backpack off without losing everything. Alright. Backpack. And... I think it gives us four more. Not a whole lot, but uh, in this game, anything is... In most games, any, any inventory you get is good. Okay. Oh, sorry about that. Alright, now let's have a look at what we need for the jetpack. Two iridium... Oh. Yeah, two iridium rods, four uranium... That is it. And I think I actually have the uranium, so I gotta go and grab some iridium uh, from over there. Sorry, just checking my inventory. Uh, what else can we unlock? What would we do? I think... I need another Lerma seed. Ooh. I don't think I have any of those. I don't. I think I'm gonna have to go exploring to find more of those, too. We'll check the, the miscellaneous chest and nothing. Alright, so I need a learn seed for that, so we're going to have to probably explore the wreck next door here. I uh, need iridium for that. need osmium for that, so I won't be doing that. And we could probably start doing this, I think. Maybe even so I get the mapping going. What do I need for the screen? A compass microchip. What do I need for the compass? Silicone. Oh, I could just... Well. The aluminum. I gotta use all my aluminum for everything. Alright, uh, I'm gonna go run over and grab some aluminum. I'll be right back. On second thought, before we go, I just unlock the atmospheric water collector. So this just basically means I get bottled water. I don't have to do any crafting. So let's grab some... What was it? What do I need? I needed magnesium and cobalt. One of those things that you need one of everything. Take one magnesium. Run over here. Take one cobalt, and I believe this does have to go outside. Yeah, it's not fitting in my living room. Not a chance. Uh, hmm. I guess we'll put it over here. Somewhere out of the way. Okay, and... Oh, it holds four bottles at a time. Okay, cool. Alright, and does it show up progress? I don't think it does. I guess not. No, I don't know if that's drawing water from the, the atmosphere or if it's collecting rainwater. I have a feeling it might be collecting rainwater. But let me check to see what the rain status is. Oh, we're already at rain. Cool. Well, that's why we unlocked the atmosphere great water collector. Anyway, uh, let me grab some aluminum and I'll be right back. Oh, would you look at that? And here, I forgot my umbrella. It is actually raining. That is cool. Very cool. 
Uh, rain effect could be a little bit better, but it definitely is early access. I know they're going to be doing a lot of work on it in the next little while. Like, as you can see at the bottom right there, it's still only version 0.4. It's definitely quite something to see it start raining. Anyway, uh, let me grab some stuff I was going to build to craft in here so I can make some water, and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Uh, apparently that thing does actually collect water right now. I've already collected some water. I didn't even realize it was animated like that. That's cool. Uh, I decided to go ahead and get the uh, iridium so we can go ahead and actually make the jetpack right now. Yay, progress today. Alright, so uh, for the thrusters, I need two iridium rods. Let's go ahead and craft two of those. Okay, and then I need the uranium that I have. I don't think I should have four pieces of that. Just enough. Perfect. And we go over here and we make two of these. One and oh, I need more super alloy. Do that. And back over to the crafter. And we make another thruster. And then we can go ahead and make the jetpack as soon as I get some titanium. Do do do. Titanium. What I'm thinking about doing is once I get these lockers out of the way, I might actually put the crafter right in here. Because uh, I won't be accessing those very often, and that's only to get up onto the roof, and we only go up there when it rains, right? Anyway, uh, jetpack. Now, I've seen seen this being used, and as far as I can tell, it basically holds space and forward, and you go in the direction that you're looking. Don't seem to get too much altitude on it. But it does fly, and it is kind of loud. I don't think we can get very high with it. No. That's interesting, but this is just tier 1, so uh, we'll be able to get some stuff. Uh, as far as... I swear to god, there's something on the ship. We're gonna have to look at this. That was actually what I was planning on doing next, is do a little bit of exploration. Uh, we'll go check and see where our terraformation is at. Uh, what it might actually do let's get rid of this because we don't need this anymore we don't need a, a little outpost outside our house Not unless we're trying to avoid the rent or something like that uh food oh, food 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 oh, look at that the beans are beans are done already sweet cool self-sustaining uh what was i doing uh i was gonna put some stuff away and we'll go explore that wreck Okay, let's go. I got one one air oxygen on me. We'll take one water. I think it's all me, and I do have one squash. And then maybe what I'll do is maybe we'll actually move this and I'll relocate it. Get some more grass growing up front here. The grass doesn't not stay. Are you serious? Oh, okay. I thought this like left the grass there permanently. Maybe it's supposed to be. It's a bug. I don't know. How are we doing here? Uh, this is... It says starts melting at 100 nano kelvin or whatever that is. Let's go quickly check on that. Let's see where we're at here. So it should be melting. I don't know why it's not. Probably early access. I don't know. But anyways, let's go see what we can find in this thing. See what I've missed. Apparently something, because I keep hearing these doors open somewhere. Uh, that's iron, don't care about that. Alright. Oh, got in just in time too. Alright, nothing. Uh, so I guess I'm just going to cut here and do some exploring and I'll bring you back if I find anything good. Okay, I am back. Uh, I did not find a single Lerma seed in there. I found three. So, we're good there. I'm actually kind of curious about this. Like it says it starts melting at a... at a certain temperature. Maybe it's already melting, I just didn't realize it. I think it is, actually. It's hard to say. Not much I can do. Oxygen helps. Uh, let's go quickly go in here, and I just want to check on that grass level quickly. Because it looks like it grew, grew back pretty quick. Uh, not really. So I guess we'll just have to get more of those. I do not know, uh, but what I do know is, I think... Yeah, I think we can actually craft that now. So, let me gather up some stuff and I'll find a place for it. 
Oh yeah, by the way, I found a whole bunch of food, some more fabric, yeah, another one of the, the Shanga seeds, which is 150%, and uh, fabrics and stuff. Okay, here's what I think I'm going to do. What I think I'm going to do is I might actually extend it off on this direction, like so. And then uh, we'll put the biodome right at the end here if I can. It's not going to let me do it from here. So that means i got to go up on the roof, I think. Let's find out. See if I can even do it from up here. Yeah, let me place it. I don't think so. Oh, yes, maybe. Alright, that uh, should be it. I haven't seen too much of this. I do know there's a whole bunch of veggie tubes inside. Let's go take a look at our magical, magical floating monstrosity. It's almost as clean as a hospital. Uh, I did grab some cobalt and iron to put windows in here, of course. Just gotta have windows, right? Alright, now, let's actually see what this is all about. Oh yes, this is the whole thing about the biomass. And so this is more stuff we can unlock by producing biomass. Algae generator. Oh, wow, this is really in-depth. Alright, now, what is this? Uh... Does this just produce? So I don't have to put seeds in it at all. Really? Let's uh, have a look at our, our statistics here. Oh yeah, up here. Oh wow. That's definitely going up. Alright, so let's see uh, what's going to get unlocked next. Uh, tier 5 backpack. Oh wow. Okay. That's a thing. A uh, flower pot. Alright, let's see what this flower pot's all about. Uh, where are you? Oh, it's decoration. Fertilizer. Where do you make fertilizer? Oh, is that the... Hang on, let me take a look at this. Uh, very interesting, so apparently I gotta generate more biomass to actually unlock this. So that, so apparently I don't have to do anything with this except just have it be here. That is good. Okay, so what was the next thing I wanted to do is, uh, well, we don't have Osmium yet. I think I have to go exploring for that. Uh, I guess the next thing is going to be the launch platform. So I need three super alloy, three titanium, three iron, and a place to put it. Well, I think I can handle the resources. I hope. Uh, we're going to have to go hunting some more. Uh, three titanium, aluminum, or titanium, iron, and super alloy. And hopefully I have enough power for this. Let's check the power situation. Nope, we're going to run out of power. Which means more solar panels. Which means more aluminum. Alright, um... Yeah, I don't know where to put this thing. Uh, I know it's something I have to access, and I saw Dre put his right here, so... Why not? If I can even find a spot for it, I don't think it'll go because... That titanium's in the way. Try that. That works. Let's do it. Perfect. Just in my way. Actually, it's not too bad. Because I usually, I usually come up that side anyways. So, I need more power. How much power does that use? 55. Alright, I may build some more solar panels and I will return. Okay, there we go. I had a few, a few more. Uh, starting in the second row now, so we are generating lots and lots of juice. Uh, I'm going to take the ladder. I've already hurt myself once, already jumped, falling off of something. I'm not going to do it again. Not in this episode, anyways. Because I had to go all the way up here. That I do know. I'm going to go up here and climb the ladder. And. Alright, so what should we do here? Oh, I actually have to build these things, so that's right. Alright, so we can get a, a heat boost, 1000%, that's actually really good. And then we can do a pressure, and then a GPS satellite, which allows uh, for mapping of, the gen mapping of the general area, which doesn't really mean too much, but that is that. Okay, so what else do we have? Let's see what goodies we have to play with. I think that was it. We have a light, we could build a light. Uh, let's go see what our progress is.
Okay, I was just looking at the time, and uh, perfect time for a storm to pull in, but I'm thinking uh, we do have some time, maybe we'll go do some more exploring, we'll go hit up that other wreck over there, and I'll see if there's anything left I haven't found that's in that one. I'm going to build a little, little, little habitat with a uh, uh, crafter and a uh, 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 blueprint screen, so if I find any chips, I can unlock them there. Uh, so let me... Uh, Get a few things together. What I was going to do before I leave is I was going to actually go and build another grass grower so we can get some more biomass going. I'm not going to worry about crafting water because I have water right here. We'll take two of those and then we'll go ahead and we'll get another grass grower going right here and take out what's left of my power. Oh wow, we survived. Alright, so um, yeah, I'm going to go pick up a few things and I'll be right back. I actually forgot I built, I forgot I built one over here. I don't have the blueprint screen in here yet. Uh, but that was the other ship I was talking about exploring. Apparently this one's pretty big from what I've seen in another video. Um, hopefully we can find some osmium soon. I have no idea where it is. Same with uh, apparently sulfur and explosive powder and other things we can get. Uh, but first, uh, we're going to go ahead and we're going to finish looting this one. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put everything in a chest. So then that way I come and grab some stuff and we can go move on to the next one. Alright, so let's go in here and see what I've missed. So, uh, I'm gonna do some exploring. I uh, probably should take some oxygen with me. And I have a new message. I guess we're gonna have to build that. Uh, what do I need? Iron, two silicon, and magnesium. Uh, what do I have in here? Uh, magnesium and silicon. Magnesium? Oh, that's not silicon. Or silicon. Nope, nope. Where are you? There you are. Silicon. Let me run back here and see what the message says. Probably failed our failed our mission and we're being extradited to the coldest, darkest planet in the system. Uh, mail. Oh. That's what I needed. Yes, good thing this stuff just laying around and that's the wrong screen. Okay. Really? Huh, interesting. Alright, we'll have to check that out later. Anyway, I'll be right back. Okay, well apparently there wasn't too much in that one. I did find another chip, so let's see what we got out of that. Uh, mining speed tier 4. I don't actually use the mining speed, so that is fine. Uh, I did find a couple more seeds, some fabric, some aluminum. And I'm just going to put that in there for now. I'm going to grab this stuff. Actually, what I need, I needed... Uh, 3 iron, 2 titanium, and 2 silicon, I think, but I'll grab that on the way to the next site. So I'll see you there. Okay, here we are. So uh, I found a little box in there, I didn't really find too much. I did find a bioplastic nugget, and I have absolutely no idea what this is or what it's for. Uh, we will find out eventually. Now the question is, how do we get into this thing? Can we get into this thing? Uh, that is a real question. I would imagine so, you don't have this, something this big just laying around not being able to... Uh, Go inside and loot it, right? Wow, oh, it's quite the desert. Now, why can't I have that jetpack thruster? No, oh, that's not a way in. Oh, here we go. I found it. Alright, uh, if I can get in. There we go. Alright. Let's see what we have here. Uh, nothing of nothing here of interest that I can see. A new. Alright, let's go inside and see what we can find. Uh, hopefully I don't get lost. Hopefully... I survive. Okay. Uh, so I'm gonna look around, I'll save you the boring parts, and I'll bring you back if I find anything. Okay, I'm back. I did get... I think most of this done. There's actually three floors, and I think I've explored every room. I did find uh, some... Nulna seeds, I got the Tusca seed, I got another blueprint chip, uh, some more bioplastic, and uh, some more super alloy, plus a iridium rod, so that's going to come in handy. I did want to quickly check the rest of these things first before I move on and see if there's anything I'm going to miss here. Uh, probably not, but you never know, right? Doesn't hurt to check, see if they're hiding any little goodies around you don't see. I don't think there's really much I can find that I would actually need. But we'll take a quick, 
quick little peek around, see if there's anything of interest. And I don't think there will be. It almost... It kind of goes gives me that Aurora feel from Subnautica. Now there's been crash landed on the island. Well... I think this is about it. I want to see if I can try to get up on top if I can't find anything. Then I'll meet you back at the base. Okay, I can't find any, anything else or anything else, any way to get in, but while we're here, I might as well go ahead and decode this ship and see what we got. Jetpacked here too. Good, let's go, go home and see what we need for that. And here we are. And the jetpack made it so much easier. Look at that, got my, got my yard back. I might have to put another one over here eventually. Uh, oh yeah, also, I did, did, did realize after the last episode I could change the color of this just by selecting that panel. I had it set up the wrong way down in the base there so I didn't actually see the panel. Uh, while we're here, let's see how we're doing. Uh, liquid water in 34... 32%. Not bad. Let's see where our progression is. Okay, we're still away from that. Uh, oh, that's a long ways away. 63 parts per billion, I guess. And we're at 1.57. Yeah, we got a ways. And sign, and there is that. Uh, what I did want to do, let's see what this tier 2 jetpack needs. Sulfur. And osmium, which I need to find. Which means exploring. Uh, which also, I think, means... Uh, come on, I can find the words here. Uh, 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 or extraction. No, because I need osmium for that. Exploration, yes, that's key. I have no idea where to go, go for exploration on that, but uh, I think we'll check that out in the next episode because I think we're running a little long here. So, anyways, I thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave me a like. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Later.